What's good YouTube? It's your boy Ashton. Uh, I'm back for another video and really before we hop into this video I really just want to chop it up with you guys real quick before. Alright so basically um, I apologize for uh, missing a week. I'm really trying to remain consistent. I really want to remain consistent and I really want to provide weekly content so y'all definitely have something to look for week after week. Let me know if y'all miss me. I was actually really busy last week. I mean, extremely busy. So I just, I just wasn't honestly able to crank out a video. It happens. I know it happens, but don't expect it too often. Don't expect that to have been me, you know, falling off again. I'm not going anywhere. Like I said, I'm trying to provide content weekly. I haven't really been keeping honest on that Wednesday schedule. It might come out Thursday or something like that, but. I'm definitely going to try to do better on cranking out a video by Wednesday. If not, I might change it to Thursday. Let me know if y'all like Thursday better, you know, down in the comment section below. And also, you know, before we also get into the video, subscribe, you know. Yeah, I ain't even going to lie, my views have kind of fallen off. I mean, I kind of expected it. I mean, I haven't been on YouTube for like two years. Definitely, let's try to crank the views back up. So, send it to your mommy, your auntie, your grandma, your little cousins your best friend, I don't give a damn if you put it on for your dog to watch, you know what I'm saying, create a channel, subscribe, you know, with your dog face on it, put it on for her, you know what I'm saying, or him, or whatever they are, you know what I mean, and, and let's, let's crank them views back up, and like I said, don't forget to subscribe, so alright, let's get to the video, gang, gang, Ugh. today's video, as y'all read by the title, is about what I've been currently wearing. And honestly, these were just like some of the quickest shit to pick up. But these are in my current rotation. So, uh, let's get into what else is in this show. Alright, so I'm not really gonna be on some YouTuber extra clean, whatever aesthetic you vibes, for real, for real. I'm gonna just show you how I really get it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm not joking. But, uh, yeah. Alright, so these are just some ones that's sitting right here, chilling. I ain't gonna cap. You know what I'm saying? The, uh, yeah, you know, double Yeezy, foam runner, Yeezy slides. I ain't gonna lie, I grab these just all the time. They're just sitting right here because that's what I've just been wearing. They're in my living room, you know, regular vibes, whatever. Alright, so now we're in the closet. So I pretty much just keep everything I'm finna rock. Or just easily grabbable shoes for real right here. Like these some go-to's right here. These some go-to's, you know what I mean? And then I'm gonna show them individually one by one so y'all get a little bit more depth of them, even though I'm pretty sure y'all kinda know what easy slides are. So you know I like I ain't gonna lie, I rock slides a whole lot, you know what I mean? So these are always just the quick go-to's. Um, where I'm missing some shoes, I ain't gonna lie. All right, so the first pair are these. I just showed y'all these in the living room, and then I also brought them in the closet. The brown easy foam slides. These joints are honestly like weirdly brown. Honestly, goes with everything. I've kind of gotten used to it. You know, I started incorporating more brown and stuff with these slides, and honestly, they go with everything. Like I'll be throwing on with vintage tees, all black or creams it, it, it just works really easily so it's just like something that i tend to put on a lot actually as often as i wear are these joints i really didn't think the color would be as like functional to wear for some reason i don't know why but crazy enough they're almost like the brown slot like i can throw these joints on with anything and they honestly be working so i tend to grab these a lot and they're mad comfortable like all the yeezy foam products are mad comfortable so it's just like why would you not throw them on for real all right to switch it up a little bit out of the yeezy kanye kind of vibes uh these these are honestly my favorite shoes like i, I put these on so much it's ridiculous like i don't know if y'all can see this but it has like a cork hold on i'm gonna just take it out i'm gonna just let me see if i can take it out uh it ain't really budging if y'all can see that, it's got a cork sole. Cork sole is honest to God amazing. Like, it's so comfortable. I don't even know why it's that comfortable, but they need to make more cork soles, like genuinely. So um, if you can get you some shoes with some cork soles, get them. But yeah, back to the shoes. 
These bad boys, these just hold me down. I, I, I honestly wear them everywhere. Like, in any situation, they go with almost every fit. You throw it on with jeans, sweatpants, shorts. It doesn't matter if the sweatpants got the cuff on them, they're wide leg sweatpants, skinny jeans, baggy jeans, cargos, you name it. These jeans can go with, and it's just a vibe, bro. I'm still wearing them. And I love these joints for real, so like, y'all might have to go pick up a pair if y'all really rocking with them like I'm rocking with them. Look, I told y'all I rock a lot of slides, and I wasn't joking. So, uh, these, these is when you want to just flex a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't gonna lie, they kind of actually low-key when you throw them on, but they still are a flex. You know, they do flex a little bit, so, uh, I can't lie, I be, uh, flexing. When I wear these. Now they, these are cool. They honestly just as versatile as the Yeezy Brown slides for real, for real. If not more versatile. They're just a little more flexy, you know. It is what it is. Like, I don't know how else to explain it. So, uh, <laughs> I, but I rock them. Like, I really fuck with these a lot. You know what I mean? And honest to God, I would have thought the wear and tear would have been worse on them. Considering that it's like canvas and you're stepping on it the whole time, but... Honestly, mine have been pretty good, and it's not like I'm shy about wearing them. They're a little dirty on the canvas, I can't lie. But, I mean, I've seen some people destroy their shits. So, I'm pretty happy with the way I've kept mine clean. And maybe Gucci might clean them for me or something. I might have to reach out to Gucci about that. So, uh, yeah. Alright, another pair that I've been wearing a lot recently are these Foam Runner. These are some, uh, some everyday shoes, bro. I don't know. Kanye just went Look, Kanye is just winning. I don't even know what to say. Whatever Kanye is doing with the shoes, with the clothes, it's just like, why not? Like, it's, I don't know. I don't get it, bro. Like, it's it's honestly crazy. Like, it's just a vibe. I won't say everything is hidden. Like, believe me, there's some shit I just don't fuck with. But, bro, be, bro, be snapping. You know what I'm saying? So, it's just, it is what it is. And these what I've been wearing, they mad comfortable. I'm not even sure which one is more comfortable between the slides and the foam runners. I think the foam runners low key might like on the lowest of keys. I don't know, but I think so, bro. Like for real, for real, I, I rock with these. So get you a pair if you don't have a pair. I know that'd be hard to get, but you know, eventually you'll win. It took me forever to win. I'll confirm that. Once I start winning, I start winning a lot. As y'all can see, that because I've been comping a bunch of Yeezys recently that I haven't normally comped. Shouts out to Adidas confirmed out. You the plug. <laughs> Alright, I can't lie. You would think these junts are new releases. They're not. These are not the new pandas or whatever y'all want to call them. The OG black and white ones or whatever. These are from like 2014, 2015. Whenever they came out. 2013, whatever. I think it might have been 2014. These <laughs> have held the test of time for me, bro. Like... They still holding up pretty good, and when that Jordan 1 and, and SB craze went on this year, I definitely pulled these out a lot. Got some good wears out of them. I haven't been wearing them as much recently, just because I've honestly been wearing all the Yeezys that I've end up coming up on in the last couple of months but man these just still classic still great i like rocking them they go with everything they black and white you know what i'm saying i got more pairs of ones remember these are about the the current rotation what i'm really wearing and uh these are one of them so shout out to jordan for making some shoes that i can pull out even when the hype get real and I don't have to go spend new money. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to Mike. <laughs> yo, no cap. These, yo, these got popular randomly earlier this year. Like, only for like a spurt. Or maybe it was just in the city that I was in. No, it wasn't even this year. It was last year. It was last year. These got ultra popular last year. Like, I was like, what's going on? Like, a lot of people have copped these. Kind of like the McQueens in a way. But a lot of people have definitely comped these in the last... I, I kind of it kind of makes sense. They only a hundred dollars. You know why not get them? They better than regular Converse. Swear to God, they're more comfortable. Whoever tell you they're not more comfortable, they lying to you. Definitely more comfortable. They got a much thicker sole that you can actually feel. It squishes everything. So these are actually lit and they look good. You know they can be worn with everything. I really like versatile footwear. If you can't tell, I don't buy crazy colors. I don't do none of that for real. They can't go with most of my wardrobe. As y'all can tell, it's pretty much black gray white tans earth tones things like that and i'm not really buying it and these kind of do that they're kind of like a poor man's rig almost because of the you know got a little what 
they call it patina i think that is when it has a little cream aging kind of vibes to it so uh, it looks good i like it i think patina with leather aging actually so maybe take that back scratch that scratch that <laughs> but yeah that's pretty much what i've been wearing as of the last couple months honestly that's really what is in my current rotation i don't really wear too much outside of that i might dip and dabble a little bit pull out some products maybe feel a little adventurous throw on the gucci's when i really feel like being loud but yeah that's pretty much what i've been on for real so uh if y'all like my current rotation let me know down in the comments also again don't forget to subscribe and what did we talk about get your auntie your grandma grandma, your dog, your best friend, your little cousin, your little brother, your big sister, anybody. Put them on this video so we can ramp the views up. Also, tell them to subscribe so we can grow this family and this army. Let's get it going. It's your boy Ashen. I'm signing out. And catch me next week for another video. Or, you never know, some might surprise you later on this week. Just Let's just see how I'm feeling and we'll get it going. Let's get it. Let's go.